In this video, I'm going to show you how you can uh, get Will the Infernal Robe and also avoid having him have the corns and so he can stay human and also recruit Carlock. This is a glitch that I think, or a bug, that's going to be definitely patched at some point. So I recommend that you create a save where you can do this if you'd like to play the game with Will without horns, but also have Carlock. You also get the Infernal Robe, which is a reward for killing Carlock, but I don't think that's as good as the cosmetic effect. Subscribe to the Linus Wilson channel. We give you the secrets to crush Baldur's Gate 3. Now, I've seen this. Uh, I want to thank Saboteur because I found his explanation pretty good, but I think Silent Gaming did this before he did a lot of people have done this so the key is that you want to recruit will will is going to be uh, at uh, the emerald grove he's going to be uh, at the practice facility by the oxes uh, you pick him up as a as a companion and then you know take him with your uh, with your party and then uh north of the blighted village there's going to be this wilderness area where carlock's going to be now what you want to do is before you get near to where carlock is and she'll even be marked on the map once you've talked to will uh you want to separate your party and so make sure will stays back but you might as well keep him and then then attack carlock you might want to attack her from a distance to start out with uh, because otherwise the dialogue might trigger. I was able to like attack her with melee before the dialogue triggered, but uh, j just keep that in mind. If you, you you shoot her with an arrow first, then you can avoid. You definitely want to avoid dialogue. You do not want to enter a dialogue with her. You also want to make sure that Will is not in this fight. And so you kill Carlock and make sure she falls someplace that you can resurrect her before you go on. I, you know, the, the, the resurrection scrolls, uh, which you can buy from the vendors uh, or steal from the vendors, the, those white scrolls, the scrolls of revivify, that's what you're going to use. But sometimes, you know, if like the, the, the fallen person uh, falls like uh, in a hole or something, it's hard to revivify him. And I, that's happened for me. So just see if it's going to let you do it but don't actually uh revivify or, or resurrect her there and then go back to will and talk to will and he's going to go through his whole spiel uh, about his second thoughts and he's achieved his goal but he's not sure it was a good goal and then then you you want to like we have your whole party go back to well actually you want to leave will there so you talk to him then you leave him there, so don't group your party, and then w revivify Carlock before you go back to camp, right? So after you, you've killed Carlock without Will there, you've talked to Will, you've revived Carlock, you've never talked to Carlock, then you go back to uh, camp, right? And at camp, you're going to long rest, and then Mizora's going to come, and Mizora's going to reward Will with the Infernal Robe. Now, I did find a kind of upsetting thing if you... if. Will is not in your group. If he's not one of the four characters in your group when Mizora comes, I, I was having trouble getting the Infernal Robe. So make sure that he is grouped with you. So you don't want to ungroup him. I mean, you want to make him in your party. You can be ungrouped, but he has to be one of the four companions, uh, four active companions, as opposed to somebody just at their tent when Mizora comes. So before you sleep, make sure that he's one of the four active companions. And you get that robe. You talk to him you complete your long rest you go back to carlock and carlock will then you have to the, have them talk and you find the non peace the non fighting options uh, which are pretty obvious and have carlock join your party and she's a permanent companion and since mizora's already had her thing will's not going to get any horns and he's also going to keep the infernal robe. Subscribe to the Linus Wilson channel. We give you the secrets to crush Baldur's Gate 3. Good luck, adventurers.